well, well, you're, you're like a hustler big time. <laughs> you're, you're, well, your your old life seemed to be like a little bit more satisfying and more um stable and fucking more oh, more. You crazy evil? Should I like start doing drugs again and drinking? Well, I mean, well, the alternative doesn't seem much better. Oh, it's much better. My life's great. I have like an amazing life. Now you're just like now you're just like now you're just like unstable, manic, depressive, and psycho. No, no, no. This you and I is just a blip. Oh yeah, I don't care about that. I'm talking about your behavior and your fucking and your overall well being. That's what I mean. My behavior, this whole thing, my behavior. Well, I don't think you're. I don't think. I don't think you're. I don't think your behavior. I don't think your behavior is just only because of only. You don't just act that way when you think of me. You, you're, it probably bleeds into the rest of your life as well. You don't. You don't. It's not a switch you can turn off and on. It's something that it's like kind of like how you are, or who you are. You know. So it's just. What? Your actions like constitute like who you, the kind of person you are. So fucking so. so I'm crazy, well, yeah, and so I mean, maybe you need to maybe you need to go smoke something, fucking, because your fucking ass is too fucking your ass is too fucking tragic. What? Hey, you know what? I mean, I'm just saying. People say drugs are so bad, and and in that in that lifestyle, whatever you want to call it, a lifestyle is so bad. But you know, what? it makes like a lot of people fucking a lot, a lot of it makes people a lot happier, fucking, at the most for the most part, because fucking like life life isn't that great, fucking sober either, so. You don't get it. Which don't is a which is a per which is a perfect. I mean, you're a perfect example of that. So I mean. No, no, you're wrong. You don't get it. Yeah. No, I get it. I've been there before. I've I've seen it all, honey. Fucking, I've been there and done that. So, I've got. I've, I've got. Well, I've got. Th I've got three up that, on me. You know that honestly, telling me to like smoke or drink is like wishing death upon me. My father died of alcoholism last year. My family was rampant with it. When I drank and used drugs, all I did was black out, and my life was. Um, but I haven't been that way for eight years. So, so who cares if I slip up every once in a while and act crazy with some dude and well, uh, send crazy texts? That's better than getting in my car like in a blackout and like you know waking up in Santa Monica and not knowing how I got there. Hey, you know what? Well, just you, all you need to do is learn control. That's all. Oh my God! Smoking like a true. Yeah, I, I went down that road, the control road, for years. Trust me. Well, no, you never really did go down that road because you just you just tried to. Trust me, I did, and my body has an allergy to anything that makes me feel good, and I snap. So you don't know control, then? I don't have my control mechanisms don't work. Oh, so you never yeah, exactly. You, so you never learned control. Yeah, but there's nothing that can give me control. Oh, never, I, never, I, never say, never say, never, honey. If if you want something bad enough, you can have it. You can, you, you know, can get I it. Call me, honey. I hate that. Oh. You know, no. don't, don't make excuses for yourself. I can't... I can have control. I do know how to have control. And it's when I am lax in certain areas of my life that I slip up, which is right now. I've been busy at work. I haven't been working out. Um, I haven't been eating right. Mm -hmm. And then okay. I should be hooking up randomly when I do. It just, like, triggers stuff. That's all it is. Oh. So it's, it's, grinders, it's grinder's fault. Well, I did get off that. I deleted that stuff. I don't need that, that soul-sucking shit in my life. Oh, why is it? Oh, it's the devil now? Pretty much. Oh, really? It is what you want it to be. You shouldn't be so dark. Well, and you didn't even get me anything. You didn't even get me anything for my birthday, you asshole. I mean, you didn't even call me on my birthday. You didn't even call me on my birthday. I'm not even a normal person. Hold on a second. Hold on, Mary. Hold on. Hold on. Hold that thought. Hold that wonderful thought of yours. Hello? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Did you send me the text? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, if you could. Could you send it to my phone, or, or do you need an email? Uh, let's see here. Yeah, I guess, um, uh, probably email would be easier for me. I'm, I'm not really that tech-savvy, to be honest. But That's uh, cool. Uh, do you have any questions about the, the kitten or anything? 
No, I just no, I just I want to see a picture real quick. Okay, it's kind of like an orange, orange tabby, um, kind of. Uh, I mean, I guess that's what they call him. Yeah. But he's got a lot of white and some orange stripes, and he's just the cutest thing. He's just uh, really, really cuddly, and, and I don't like cats. You know, and I'm really allergic, but he's he's a really, really nice cat. Right on. Uh, and we we even took him to the vet today just to get him checked up and got him another you know vaccination or whatever. And he's all he's all set. Um, he's like eight weeks old, so he's just a cute little guy. I'll, I'll take a picture. Okay. And, um, let's see here. Give me your give me your email address if you can. Okay. Or did you did you send me an email for Craigslist? Yeah, I did. Okay, then maybe I can go on there and just uh, send you an email there. Okay, cool. All right. Thanks a lot. What's your name? Uh, Jake. Jake. Okay. Yeah. Thanks, Jake. Thank you. Bye bye. Bye bye. Okay, we hung up, I guess. Did you get it? No, I was, gonna, I was thinking about getting it, I don't know, for my mom or something. I don't know. I don't know. Sissy needs, Sissy needs a boy kitty to fuck. Come here, Sissy.